Dark matter makes up the bulk of the cluster material, nearly 90% by mass. The gravitational force of the dark matter dominates the physics of the merger, but the dark matter itself is thought to be collisionless. The individual particles themselves do not collide with each other, but they are completely redistributed through the quickly changing gravitational potential in a process known as violent relaxation. Most of the cluster's ordinary matter is in the form of a hot diffuse plasma known as the intracluster medium. Unlike the dark matter, the gases interact directly, and large features such as plumes and bridges form during the course of the merger as the gas is dragged along under the gravitational influence of the dark matter. The orbital motion of the two clusters stirs the intracluster medium, driving turbulent motions and heating up the gas further. The mixing variable M shows the degree to which the two cluster gases have mixed. Initially, there is only minor mixing along the boundary between the two cluster components. But after the first passage of the clusters, the gas cores recollide, and the resulting stirring of the gas mixes the two cluster gases thoroughly. When the dark matter particles are visualized along with the mixing variable, it becomes clear that there is a significant difference between the behavior of the dark matter and the behavior of the gas. The two dark matter cores slip past and through each other, whereas the two gas components interact and mix. It is also clearly seen that the mixing of the gas is driven completely by the violent orbital motion of the dark matter cores.